One, two, three, start. Hi, so uh, this is now Sir Fawad Bagas with us, um, the ex West Indian and US player. Uh, we're at the University of South Florida, just uh, playing with him today, and it's a great opportunity for the university. So, sir, um, how he's not playing with, he's playing against. <laughs> uh, how was your How was your cricketing experience? In, in, in a simple sentence, it's very difficult to explain in one word, but like everything else, there's no substitute for experience. The traveling and the people you play against and the experience you gain from the different, uh, how do I put it, the cultures and stuff is very, very rewarding. Okay, and um, what would you say was the highlight of your cricketing career? The one moment that every cricketer has? I scored 250 against India in a place they call Kanpur um, against uh, the Indian team which was which had Sunil Gavaskar, uh, Gavri, Kapil Dev, Amanat and those guys. We played in a place in Kanpur. What make what made it made me feel good? It wasn't just a double hundred. It was a double hundred that was made on a wet wicket. In those days they had a Next day it rained the entire day, and then about uh, we usually start at I think uh, like 30, and about 11 the forced play. We went out to play, but we were playing on a wet wicket. I mean, we had Venkata Raghavan bowling, and he would pitch the ball, and it was in being in trouble. The ball would just hit the ball. That's why I think it's about the highlights. And um, at, at your age, I mean. What, what drives you to keep continuing and playing in um, this FCC team? Exercise, help, and once you've played cricket, there's something in your blood. It doesn't matter how old you are, if you can't physically do it, you'll find the people who have played will always be around the cricket. But I enjoy it and um, I have no complaints. I'm trying to stay healthy. Well, you inspire all of us at this age. If we can continue, then we would like to at least keep playing for a while. Um, You're a good liar, but that's all right. I don't have <laughs> you do it. We, every time, I mean, I played this the second time playing against you. So, um, and you got me for zero last time. Shit. <laughs> <laughs> but, uh, but the whole idea is, um, you know, when you come out, at least you learn a little bit of stat status to the game. And people enjoy being there. Not everybody. Some people enjoy it. Some people are jealous. Uh, some hate you for whatever reason. But I'm here not for that. I'm just here. For okay. And um, the, this league, uh, a lot of USF players play in this league. We've been preparing. Um, how would you say the talent level is of this league? Not to compare with any other league, but just uh, the competitive nature of the league and in this game of cricket. Yeah. Um, there's a few teams that stand out. There's um, individuals all around. And I could call some names. I believe Sai plays with you guys. Um, there's the Patel boys. Uh, they have, how do I put it? They have to come a long way, but then when it has moved on, I mean, 20, 20, 30 of cricket, uh, one day cricket has uh, actually moved on and cricket has changed. But the important thing in the end is uh, the guy who hits the ball and hits more successfully or the bowler who bowls and gets more wickets or the feeling team that save more runs will win. It's not about technique or class anymore, it's about, you know, like baseball, how far you can hit it. Thank you, thank you for the interview. And this was the, no, no the great Pal because that we're uh, lucky to play against okay. and uh, uh, he's supporting University of South Florida. Yes, go Bulls! So I will, I will. Go Bulls, go Bulls. I got a shirt. Right, yeah. <laughs> I'm going to sleep in it. Alright, that was it. Thank right. you. See you thank guys. you. Thank you. Thank you. It wasn't hard. <laughs>